literally we do everything in five days and literally the children help with everything from the script to actually performing on the stage and they even sell the tickets so there is no real preparation because we don't know who we're gonna get coming through the door this is all led by the children we want the ummah to notice what we are doing and sponsor our events because we are trying to inspire the next generation we are talking about topics that are needed like for instance addiction to mobiles as we did today but we are also bringing them back to the Quran and the Sunnah this is something that's really unique and we're doing this through drama and filmmaking and productions I think um, for a lot of the children it was more of a fun event so for them it, every day was you know very different they were happy excited and then uh, I think today it really settled in sir sir what are we doing what are we doing I don't know what I'm doing sir so, uh, but eventually we got there, Alhamdulillah, and um, by the grace of Allah, it was a beautiful performance. Alhamdulillah. So, how many kids were involved in the, in the play? Uh, we had about 70 children, so that's about 35 um, girls and 35 boys. So, <laughs> give or take, some did um, got ill or didn't turn uh, come back in. But there, it was. Uh, see, I'm losing my mind now. <laughs> but yeah, it was about 70 children. Absolutely insane. I think it's the biggest one we've done uh, this year. This week I've been with Anissa behind the scenes working here at Creative Change. It has been absolutely phenomenal. It's something so needed in our communities for the youth and just seeing it unfold, having them connecting creatively and with the Dean. I'm blown away, blown away. I'm a lab technician, um, so I host, um, I host some parts of the play, I um, I tell I um, check people for the symptoms that they have in mobileitis, um, which is a disease that um, or a virus that comes from phones. Yes, it's not even just the the play itself, just the preparation for the whole week event that they had. Um, just the idea that they're networking with other children, other Muslim kids, their, their whole tarbiya, like, you know, just to see other parents, the parents networking, the effect goes way beyond just the, the day of the play itself. And then the play itself, you know, you see their confidence, their excitement, they their, their get into character, and you just, it's really lovely to see them develop like that, you know. I really enjoyed the play because, like, I've always been into acting since I was younger. Like, I didn't participate, but, like, seeing my brothers, like, on the stage, like, I really think that acting can really help build your confidence and help you project and like they also did a lot of improvising in it as well and like I'm really really proud of them that they decided to um, join this um, summer camp. These kind of uh, summer camps especially for you know the community that basically we are uh, scared of uh, nowadays you know that the kids are basically using unnecessarily a lot of devices uh, especially, you know, they are going on social media and YouTube without parents' notice and uh, that's what is too scary, to be honest, and this kind of summer camp is basically help the community, especially the kids, that because not, you know, like uh, waste their time on unnecessary stuff.